Hey, what is going on everybody? My name is Deathbringer and welcome back to some Black Ops 2 Search and Destroy. So, today what I've actually got for you is a different kind of gameplay from me. I've actually watched this back a few times and it's, it's very astonishing um, to see myself play like this. I play really, really slow. I'm generally camping behind head glitches the whole game. And the main reason behind this is because I'm using the Foul Assault Rifle. And during the beginning of the game, I know people absolutely abused this weapon um, with the select fire attachment. And I wasn't particularly keen on it. I've never been really good with single shot weapons or sort of burst fire weapons. I prefer to stick to fully automatic assault rifles and some machine guns. But this foul is absolutely monstrous once you get into it. And I've been testing it out and I found that the best loadout for me in Search and Destroy is the red dot sight and the grip attachments on this foul OSW. It's just so beast, ended up getting 15 kills on slums and uh, I hope you enjoyed the video basically. So, I wanted to talk about something other than Call of Duty today. I actually wanted to ask you guys for some advice and opinions on what I should do next for my YouTube channel because Call of Duty, as we all know, there's only so much that me as a director and other people posting this content on YouTube can talk about it. There's only so much we can talk about Search and Destroy and I feel like it's come to a time right now where I would rather talk about things that are going on in my personal life, my own stories and my own experiences. The main reason behind this is because I've noticed that my views have dropped a hell of a lot lately. And I actually don't blame anybody for that, only myself, because I always talk about Call of Duty and a lot of you out there will know who watch me that, fair enough, I am a very, very good player at this game and I like to post beast content. I talk really good things about S&D, but the majority of people actually don't care about gameplay anymore on YouTube and I kind of want to move away from this, but not totally. I still want to be posting great gameplays, still want to be taking, um, sorry, talking tips and tricks for you guys, but I really do want to experiment a little bit. So, what I was hoping um, from you guys in the comment section below was to leave some topics, something that you might want me to talk about in real life or to do with gaming. Would you like me to talk about girls or... Um, what I do as hobbies other than gaming. What would you like me to talk about? You know, I really want to hear your stuff. I really want to hear what you think. So, that's basically the commentary for today. Um, I hope I haven't been too repetitive. I know I'm always trying to improve upon my commentaries. I know throughout this, the commentary right now, I've said a few words over and over, and I'm kind of trying to get better at that. So. Yeah, this is the end of the gameplay right now. I suffered one death. I look forward to reading your feedback. And this was a great gameplay, my friends. I will thank you for watching right there as I die in a momento. And I will see you next time. Make sure you rate the video and all that good stuff. It really helps me out a lot. Thank you for watching. Follow me on Twitter. Have a nice day. Vegeta, what does the scouter say about his power level? It's over 9,000!